Uh, guys, welcome second. to tennis.com.au. Carsten, welcome to the second round of the Grand Slam. Take us through that match. Uh, yeah, it was good. Uh, first time qualifying in a Grand Slam and played a fellow qualifier, so it was a, it was a tough match for the first set. Uh, I was down 4-1 in the first set breaker, but uh, got through that and ran through the match pretty well. So once you got back from 4-1 down in the breaker, your confidence seemed to grow and grow and grow. Yeah, from being down 4 in the breaker and then winning at 7-5, um, after that I started to serve better and, and play with more confidence and then see the finish line closer and closer. Dad, how did you see? Uh, I thought he served better as the match went on. You know, a little bit obviously nerves to start with a little bit for the first few games. The other guy was playing well, he's got a great backhand, the other guy, and Carson mixed the ball up. Did a, did a lot of high spinning balls into his backhand, sliced him a little bit, so I think that took him out of his rhythm a little bit. So uh, that was good, and he broke early in the second, broke early in the third, and just served, hung on well by serving really good, and uh, that was it. A few raucous Aussie fans in there, did you hear them much? Yeah, a few of the fanatics came over. Um, a gentleman who's, who's followed us everywhere, so that's good. And it was good to see him. There's there quite a few actually making a lot of ruckus. So that little chant going after there every time I hit an ace, which was fun. And now it all gets serious again in another couple of days. You take on a fairly reasonable player, Novak Djokovic. Yeah, yeah, you know, I think that speaks for itself. And I'm just going to go out and, and try and do my best. And Sid, what do, you, what do you do over these next couple of days to prepare him both physically and mentally? Oh, I think we'll just enjoy the win tonight, have a good good meal, take it easy. We've got a good practice with one of the French boys tomorrow and uh, we'll talk a little bit of strategy. I think he's just got to go out and enjoy this match and, and, and play everything off the front foot whenever he can. Go out and hit the ball and when you play these guys, they don't really give it to you. You've got to go and take it from them. So I think if that mentality to be a bit more aggressive and just let it let it go from there. See wherever it falls, we'll take it. All right, thanks, Ed.